Um, I was going to ask you about showbiz. Is it is it, is it too woke? I mean, there aren't many people like you who. Oh, you... I think everyone's yeah. terrified of losing their job, and so when I talk to my friends in LA, and I'm like, "Why aren't you saying no to that? Why are you, why aren't you refusing that stupid request or or what have you?" They're like, "Holly, you don't understand. You can't say anything. Everyone's on the same." What's an example of that request? Um, having to be jabbed fourteen thousand times to say a few words in front of a camera. Right. Why? Right. Is that a COVID thing or just jabs? Uh, specifically COVID. Right. I don't know of time before that we've been required to yeah. boost, boost, boost. Yeah. So away, but away, and political things too, though, away from COVID. I mean, well, that is political. But yeah, 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 fair enough. But also political ideas, maybe, or subscribing to the... Uh, I think they all expect you to be a Democrat, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You get kind of shunned and you wouldn't be living in California, really, and being a vocal Republican and in show business. You're not ticking enough boxes. You'll move somewhere else. Yeah, it's hard. And, and do you find people trying to, they can't, they can't expect you find secret people they believe like you and into right wing ideas? So many are. So, so many. I'm like, what, what do, why is this a big secret? I don't, what's, isn't it the land of the free and aren't we supposed to have free speech here? And it doesn't make any sense. And I think once you sort of open up that dialogue with people and they sort of start talking about it, like it's been three years of just such weird stuff going on in the world. Um, more and more people are waking up to it now, I suppose. So they're feeling a little bit more brave to talk about it or refuse things or...